I am Tony Suggs. I play this wonderful piano here. It has 88 keys. Well, it varies sometimes. Uh, I've been in Tokyo since approximately 2009. I moved here since 2019 now, so it's about 10 years I've been living here. Tokyo jazz scene. Is that Tokyo jazz scene? Yes, that is. Because uh, when I first got here, I was seeking it out. Um, I was hanging with a guy named Toku. He's a Sony recording artist. He sings and he plays trumpet and flugelhorn. Uh, uh, I just kept asking, all right, where are you hanging tonight? And we just kept hitting different spots. So there's, there's a scene for the, the young, up-and-coming musician uh, here in Tokyo. Uh, before I moved to Tokyo, I had the pleasure of living on the East Coast that's of the United States, mainly New York and New Jersey, for 12 years. So uh, it's a different, um, there are similarities. Um, and there are, there are certain clubs that, that harbor uh, jam sessions. Uh, when you first move into a city, that's what you have to you have to take part in that session kind of um, scene to get your name out, so people know that you're in town and you have a. It's like an outlet to pass your information on. Oh, he can play. All right, okay. It's kind of like a mini audition. Most jam sessions, if uh, be they may. <laughs> okay, uh, practice. I guess in everybody's stages, I want to say about practice, uh, since I kind of teach a few students here. Um, we're all at different stages. Uh, you have the practice whole manga who cannot put his instrument down. He's so in love with the instrument, it's like a part of him. And I guess if you're a genius and you want to be characterized as that way, um, then everywhere you go, that, that should be something you can touch. Uh, if you can do that practice, that kind of practice, uh, uh, then you're, you're destined for greatness because you want to get it right once uh, on no matter what stage or what style you're playing. Uh, if the light is on you, you want to play your best and not, not only how that's going to happen is some dedicated practice time uh, each day. Um, that's snare, yeah, no other way around that. Number one, East or West Coast Jazz, East Coast. Number two, Keith Jarrett, the Thelonious Monk. Let on this monk. Number three, tea or coffee? Tea. Number four, 10 p.m. or 2 a.m.? I'm gonna say 10 p.m. Ah, uh, number five, duo, trio, quartet. I'm gonna say trio. Number six, major, minor, and why? <laughs> That's a trick question because what's major is also minor. <laughs> Got you. Didn't get me. Number seven. What one album would you take to a desert island? Hmm. Wow, that's a good one. Good one. Good one. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say uh, Herbie Hancock's Inventions and Dimensions. Uh, I'm gonna go see Ella and Billy. I'm gonna say Ella. Uh, favorite jazz record label. Uh, when I was young, I was trying to get everything Blue Note ever put out. So Blue Note, I have to say that. Favorite jazz, Japanese jazz artist. Ah, wow, do I have a favorite? Uh. Well, I guess I, I have to say Toku because he's my friend uh, and I've played much in a lot of his music. So um, he's rocking the jazz scene here. Most requested piece of music, I'm gonna say Danny Boy. Uh, and it's not really jazz, but People ask love, actually love that anymore. And my biggest musical influence would have to be, again, that's another trick question because um, there was a guy, Ron Carter, uh, the saxophonist who inspired so many people to really embrace music. Uh, and I guess I, I'm gonna leave it at Ron Carter because if it hadn't been him for him, I probably wouldn't be sitting here doing this interview. Um, so I'm gonna say Ron Carter, the, the educator uh, the mentor, the saxophonist, the guy who's taught me how to say do dit da. That's a that's an eight note quarter note, eight note do dit da. That musical phrase that was swinging. Do dit da. If I had to say somebody else, mm, Win Kelly, uh, the way he swung, I love what, the way he played his notes. But I have more than Win Kelly in terms of. Piano, there are a whole lot of, but Willie Kelly, the how he swung with Miles, 
I dug. Yeah, I think I did it. Yeah, interview. Cut. <laughs> ah.